The Alaha fitting yard at Alaju was thrown into a state of mourning Wednesday as family and friends gathered to mark one week of the death of Richard Yabwedi. <laughs> The mother of the disease, Gladys Sewa, could not be controlled. <laughs> Work at the entire fitting yard was halted for the day as the mechanics blocked access to mourn their colleague and friend. Gladys Sewa, as well as the entire family and friends of Richard Yabwedi, have just one wish to see justice delivered with dispatch. <laughs> It is surprising that none of the family of the accused has visited us. We plead that they should show up so that together we can discuss the challenge. A brother and a spokesperson for the family, Daniel Sifa, thanked the police administration for the steps taken so far with the case. This case so far has shown that the police can do other than what they are often accused of. We realize that they are not only out there for money. We know the laws are working and we will want it to end in this way. Richard Yabwedi passed on on Wednesday, August 9, a day after he was shot by the accused at the Alaha Fetting Yard on Tuesday. The suspect is currently in police custody after being remanded by an Abekata Street Magistrate Court to reappear on Wednesday, August 30. <laughs>